The Green Loop is a seven kilometer route encircling the town of White Hill and Borden, connecting nature, homes, and businesses. The loop makes White Hill and Borden more walkable, cyclable, and accessible. It reduces car dependency, increases biodiversity, and encourages exercise. And it's all tied together by wayfinding signs that will keep you on track while you get lost in nature. Cycling with your family on the weekend, heading to the cafe for a lunch meeting, walking the dog at sunset. From dawn to dusk, the Green Loop makes White Hill and Borden a safer, healthier, and more fun place to live and work. The Green Loop traces the outskirts of White Hill and Borden, running through parks, woodlands, and residential areas, where you might be walking the dog, picking up a cuppa from a local independent coffee shop, or just taking a relaxing stroll beside ponds and rivers. It connects onto a single route that's easy to follow, where you'll bump into friends whilst you make your way to nearby shops, restaurants and community centres. The loop unites a network of paths and cycle routes, leading deeper into the town centre and further out into White Hill and Borden's rich natural surroundings, with open glades amid the woodlands where you can stop, rest, admire public art, and read about the area's history. The Green Loop is for tail wags and chin wags, heading to school and heading home, with a detour, of course. It's for warming up, beating personal bests, and cooling down. It's for taking things at your own pace, reflecting, refueling, finding the balance in life. It's for everyone. The Green Loop makes White Hill and Borden a happier, healthier, better connected, greener town. It has been made possible by a joint bid by East Hampshire District Council and Hampshire County Council, submitted to the Enterprise M3 Local Enterprise Partnership with collaboration from White Hill Borden Regeneration Company, Defence Infrastructure Organisation and White Hill Town Council. The Green Loop was further funded by Section 106 developer contributions and additionally made possible by other landowners.